Hi there, I'm Black Bright and I'm broadcast out of the UK. I'm kind of doing videos when I've got broadband. I've still got problems with broadband. Um, Virgin is supposed to be delivering a new box sometime this week and hopefully I will have broadband then. So what I'm intending to do is I can't do broadband, I can't do my videos every day. So when I do get an opportunity and there is a little slot or I kind of find some way to get Wi-Fi, then I'll upload them. So you might be inundated one minute and not get nothing the, way, the next, but this is why. I kind of do the videos as and when, and then I store them, and I can only upload them when I've got broadband, which isn't very often at the moment. Okay, so what am I going to talk about today? I'm going to talk about the new child benefit um, changes um, for those people with limited leave to remain or enter the UK. It's quite complex, so you probably won't understand one word as I don't, so you're going to need to see an immigration lawyer. I'm just going to let you know exactly what it says so you can take this information to an immigration lawyer. If you have children who you're claiming for in the EU or EEA countries, um, it doesn't apply to anyone else, I don't think. Um, it doesn't apply to people on asylum or um, refugees. So I'm going to read it out to you and see if you can make head or tail of it because I'm just speculating and I, with my limited knowledge, this is what I've translated. That's why I said you need to go to an immigration lawyer. Okay, Regulation 2 inserts new paragraphs in brackets 4, in brackets C, and in brackets 3 and in brackets C, into regulations 23 and 27 of child benefit regulations, respectively. These provide that a person with limited leave to enter or remain in the United Kingdom under the Immigration Act 1971, which has been granted by virtue of Appendix EU, is treated as not being in Great Britain or Northern Ireland, respectively. If that person would fall within paragraph in brackets 4, in brackets A or in brackets B of regulation 23 or paragraph in brackets 3, in brackets A or in brackets B of regulation 27 without such leave. I mean, really, really, why can't they put it out in plain English for people to understand. Um, like I said, my interpretation of that is that if you are in the country on limited leave to remain from the EU or EEA countries, that you cannot claim child benefit for your children. Um, or is it child tax credit? Anyway, one of them. I, I, I really, it's not clear to me what it's referring to. Well it's, really, well, it's referring to child benefit regulations, but I don't know if child tax credit comes within that. But my point is, is that I can make, I can interpret it that way, but it doesn't mean that's what it is. That's why I said you really need to see an attorney if you think it might apply to you. It doesn't apply to, like I said, asylum seekers and people like that. Um, it says regulation three inserts new paragraph in brackets, B in brackets, the three little ones, close brackets, into regulation three of the residence regulations, which makes equivalent provision in relation to those regulations. A full impact assessment has not been produced for this instrument as no impact on the private or voluntary sectors is foreseen. So you need to look up you know, put in your browser or what you take to your attorney, your immigration attorney. New regulations in bracket 16 April 2019. The title is Child Benefit and Child Tax Credit in brackets Amendment in brackets EU Exit Regulations 2019. In brackets SI dot NO dot eight six seven oblique 2019. New regulations issued in relation to child benefit and child tax credit for those granted leave to enter or remain under the EU, European Union. 
So um, that's all I can really help you with on this one. I'm really just alerting you that it is an amendment. Came out um, 16th of April, but I think it came into force on the 7th of May, which was last month, or well, this month, earlier this month. Just in case um, those of you who don't know about it. So yeah, just check it out. That's all I can do for you on this one. All right then. Bye-bye.